One of the coldest mornings of the season so far didn't stop U of M researchers from doing a very involved deer study. They were at Elm Creek Park Reserve in Maple Grove to capture and study deer using a helicopter. John Lordson was there and shows us what they're hoping to learn. I think it's right now it's single digits, but it's above zero, so that's good. On a frigid Friday morning, Three Rivers Park District and U of M researchers took part in a different kind of deer hunt. A team shot nets from a helicopter to capture and restrain deer and then delivered them to a home base set up at Elm Creek Park Reserve where the animals underwent a number of tests. We're testing them for SARS-CoV-2, the causative agent of COVID-19. We'll also be testing them for chronic wasting disease, Lyme disease, and other diseases as well. And just like hunting, some of the deer got away. But those who were captured... <laughs> received nasal swabs, had blood drawn, and were fitted with a GPS collar before being released back into the park. U of M Associate Professor Megan Kraft says they'll monitor the deer's movements over the next two years. We actually know little about how deer move and what resources they use. So what we're doing here is we're trying to figure out um, what the deer are eating, where they go during the day and season, and um, what this can have, what implications this can have for, you know, even human wildlife conflict. The team says the park is perfect for this kind of research. Elm Creek has over 5,000 acres of woodlands and prairies. And Kraft says there's a lot to take away from this type of aerial research because humans and deer actually have a lot in common. They carry the same strains that humans do. And, um, you know, we might be worried about recombination in the deer that then might spill back into humans because the deer seem to pass the SARS CoV 2 uh, well amongst themselves. In Maple Grove, John Lordson, WCCO News. This is the second year of the U of M and Three Rivers Park District that they have partnered for the aerial deer research. The U of M team has done similar studies this winter in Carver and near Shakopee.